Usually you see me playing Atelier guitars in all of my videos, but I found a company on eBay making hand-wound pickups, and I just had to share it with everyone. Now this is not an Atelier guitar. This is a guitar that I had uh, bought some parts from uh, here and there, and I had a friend of mine put it together for me. So I wanted to share this video. Let's take a look at the pickups and um, I will go over in detail exactly what's inside the guitar here. Uh, I will say the parts on the inside of the guitar were ordered from Stuart McDonald. Pretty good website to check out. But the pickups were ordered from a company off eBay called Swenson. Swenson Pickups. I think that's how you say it. I will put a link to his website in the description below. And um, when I ordered the pickups... The uh, bridge pickup was a little too hot for me, so he just ordered me another one, no questions asked. And um, I've been pretty, pretty excited about the tone coming from the guitar. Let's take a listen to what the pickups sound like, and you be the judge. Here we go. And this is the 1960s set. Here we go in the neck position. This is the neck in the middle pickup. Definitely sounding great. And let's go into the next position. Kind of reminds me of a telly on that one. All right, let's hit that bridge. I really like the bridge pickup. You can really slap it around pretty good there. We are going to use a pedal in this video. It's the Battering Ram from Wounded Paw FX. Really love this pedal because it uh, definitely offers a lot. It has uh, great tone controls on it, and you can split the pedal because it's an overdrive and a fuzz. also has an octave on it. So let's check it out. I will be going in the neck position. And the, um, the pedal, it's uh, definitely uh, touch sensitive. The lighter I pick, it changes the effect of the pedal. But I did experiment a little bit further with uh, the BB preamp. Let's try to run it together with the Wounded Paw effects. <laughs> Definitely kind of cool. I really like uh, running those together. Let's try to run the overdrive channel on this Fender Hot Rod Deluxe. Definitely got some um, Hendrix tones there. I really love it. And um, of course, you can't beat that, man. That's. That's killer. I just really love the uh, pickups. They really do sound great. And on eBay, he's doing quite well with his uh, customer satisfaction. And uh, I'm just glad to uh, do the video for him because uh, I do believe there's not one single video out there on this company. As far as the guitar goes, it's... Um, <laughs> It still needs a whole lot of work. The neck is um, is nothing like an Attila guitar. 
it's uh it's it's gonna need a whole new fret job on it and uh, i don't even know if that will help completely but uh, it definitely has a lot of issues still but it's um it's like a parts caster you know it's uh, a whole lot of parts from a whole lot of places so and it's um it's um it's a work in progress for sure all righty i hope you like the video the pickups i highly recommend them and um uh, i um uh, i'm hoping to get some in the atella guitar because that guitar is um the best guitar i played in my life this is tim calloway just trying to keep it real have a great day okay